watch till the end to get the full recipe. Who you know when legit and made it about the hood? Who you know when legit and made it about the hood? Okay, so this meal is so easy. It's inspired from one of my favorite hometown meals, um, Coney Grilled Chicken Pitas. I mean, that El Georgie's on Six Mile. I'm trying to perfect that because I'm all the way in Georgia. But all you're going to need is some pita bread, some chicken breast. You're going to need some onion and um, tomato. You're going to need some salt and pepper, some olive oil, some Italian dressing. Um, I use some Kobe and Jack, but any type of sliced cheese. And I like to have some Swiss cheese as well. And that's about it. So let's get started. Okay, so first we're going to season up our chicken strips or chicken breast. Go ahead in with a nice amount of olive oil. Then add a nice amount of salt and a nice amount of pepper. Then you're just going to go ahead and just... Coat that up and toss those ingredients around on the chicken very good. Okay, next get a pan. Turn it on like a high to medium, medium to high heat. Um, you want that pan very hot because you want to get like a grill mark on that chicken. Um, you're going to spray it with some Pam. And then check to see if it's hot enough. And then just go right in and add your chicken. You're gonna let those cook for about five minutes on that side. And then while that's cooking, go ahead and um, put some olive oil in the pan and let that heat up. And chop up your onion. Oh, but don't forget to subscribe and hit that post notification bell so you won't be stressed about what to cook and have one less thing to worry about. And then you're just gonna saute those for a few minutes as well, sort of like a grilled onion. Go ahead and flip your chicken. You're gonna be looking for that little pan sear grill like um, on the side. And then um, once that's done, go ahead and take your um, onions off the eye and just put those on a plate or something on the side. Okay, then you're gonna go ahead and cook your chicken on the other side for about three to four minutes. And then just go ahead and chop it into bite-sized pieces. You can make it as big or as small as you want. Okay, next go ahead and add a nice amount of Italian dressing. And you can add a little dollop of butter if you want, it's optional. Okay, and then just give that a little mix around and turn your heat off and that's done. Okay, go ahead and spray some non-stick spray in that pan that you grilled your onions in. Go ahead and add a little bit of butter and let that melt down. And then you're just gonna go ahead and add your pita bread and let that cook for just a, about a minute or less on one side. You're on a medium heat. And then you're gonna flip that over. And then just go ahead and add your slice of cheese and begin to let that melt down. And then you're gonna add some mayo and just um, even that out. Okay, then add a nice amount of your grilled chicken on top. Add your Swiss cheese. Add your onion and add your tomato. Go ahead, plate and serve. And there you have it. My take on Detroit style grilled chicken pita. I hope you enjoy this recipe. I really love it. It's one of my favorite because I can't go to Detroit every day or every week. Um, so I try to take some meals and recreate them. Mmm, eat your scream. I'll see you next time. Mm.
Hey, what's up, guys? It's Verbal Ace, beatboxer from outer Good. space. I just want to say thank you so much for supporting Let me see my channel. Before we begin with I this episode, make sure you click the subscribe button it. and turn on that mm -hmm. notification bell so you'll be the first to know when I post some brand new videos. Thanks again. Well, they're watching you, too. They're not watching each your screen. Okay. Well, you you eating one of each your screens recipe. I only like that we make the YouTube. I'm not into the alien cooking. <laughs> okay, you just like that we make the videos, but you're not into watching, eating, or cooking. Mm -hmm. Thanos' performance oh, okay. had the entire planet shaking as he beat Bob. All right. So you guys like this recipe? Thumbs up. Who be? For all the infidels, non-believers, taking this shit to higher grounds, man. Let's go.